Hey gorgeous. So I wanted to invite you to something so special that I'm doing on April 20th. It is a retreat style experience called Sacraments of the Feminine. And this is something that I've been wanting to offer for a while now. And as I have opened the doors for my legacy program, Sovereign, which is a nine month modern mystery school of ancient feminine wisdom, I thought one of the best ways that I can really bring women into what it will be like to be part of Sovereign is to host essentially a mini initiation. And as someone who grew up Catholic, I went through 10 years of Catholic school and have spent the better part of the last decade really healing religious trauma within myself, deconditioning the misogynistic and patriarchal organized religion perspective and beliefs. One thing that I've yearned for and have given myself and want to give to you is really a reclamation of sacraments, a reclamation of rites of passage, a reclamation of sacred moments and sacred rituals that puts the feminine at the center. Now, for me, when I look back over the last 3,500 years that the patriarchy's really been in charge, I continually come back to the fact that when the patriarchy made the monotheistic, the one divine figure man, so I always say, when the patriarchy took the feminine out of the divine, and then the divine out of the feminine body, that is truly when this deep wounding of the feminine occurred. And for so many of us with religious upbringing, or even if you didn't really grow up in a religious household, chances are you grew up in a country that had a strong religious uh, influence because the majority of the Western world was founded on and through whether it be the Catholic Church or Islam or <laughs> Judaism, right? And so for us as women living in a culture and a society that overtly and covertly tells us that because we were born a woman, we are worth less than a man, that the feminine is worth worth less than the masculine and that the feminine is not inherently divine in the way the masculine is, that core wounding leads to so much of what the modern woman and specifically the modern female leader is struggling with. The visibility, the worthiness issues, the boundaries, like how do you step into a leadership, into leadership that feels authentic for you? How do you lead other women if you're afraid of them or judge them? How do you cultivate an incredibly supportive and passionate partnership while you're also leading a huge thing in the world? And so for the sacraments of the feminine, I'm going to be leading you through sacraments, right? So sacred moments, sacred rites of passage, sacred rituals that's going to help you reclaim the initiations, the holy moments, the rituals that so many of us grew up with, but were told or shown or taught that it had to happen through men and the masculine. And so I want to invite you personally to join me. This is going to be such an incredible experience. When you sign up, you have lifetime access to this retreat style experience. So even if you can't make it live, make sure that you register for it because you'll be able to go back and watch it anytime you want and as many times as you want. It, this is open to any and every woman who wants to deepen her connection to her embodied feminine and the divine feminine, who really wants a space with other women to be led through rituals and processes that begin to merge 
the embodied feminine and the divine feminine in a way that truly honors woman and honors spirituality and the divine. And quite frankly, it doesn't matter if you're spiritual or religious, but if you just want to deepen your own connection to yourself and to your feminine, this is an incredible space to do it. So you can just go to themagneticwoman.com backslash sacraments, plural, and register. Now this is a paid retreat style experience, but I made the payment such a no brainer. Now the reason why I am requiring you to invest in this is because I truly and deeply believe that when we take a stand and invest in our feminine, in the ways that we invest in mindset and business and going out, that unconsciously and collectively begins to rise the feminine up to be equal to and or even in more reverence of being in more reverence of the feminine than we are in the masculine, right? It's so easy for those of us, especially entrepreneurs and leaders, to sign up for a retreat style experience around money or mindset or business structure. And all of that is so deeply important. But if you're a woman who is committed to living from her feminine and embodying her feminine leadership, then you have to be willing to see it as equal to and hold it in as much reverence as you do the masculine elements of life. So please join me April 20th. There will be more information, more marketing, of course, coming out. But again, I just wanted to send you a personal invite. I'll see you soon.